Welcome back. Disabled veterans who are unable to work are entitled to certain benefits from the federal government. When their injury or illness has been proven to be connected to their service, however, sometimes those benefits are denied and it can be a long, difficult process to receive what's rightfully theirs. And Jim Brzezinski is an attorney with Tayback Law and is accredited by the VA to help veterans, especially in situations like that. Good morning. Good morning. So let's talk a little bit about that, uh, what we just mentioned there. What if someone has a service-connected disability and they are unable able to work because of it. Well, yeah, there, as you mentioned, there are uh, certain benefits <coughs> through the VA if the person is unable to work. Um, th the way it works is when somebody is service connected, the VA has uh, a table based on certain symptoms and they would get a percentage. So it could be 10%, 20%. However, those percentages don't always uh, really take into account the limitations for that uh, disability or condition that mm -hmm. the person might have. Now, if those limitations are so bad that the person can't work, they can file for what's called unemployability or individual unemployability and uh, can be granted a 100% disability rating based on not being able to work. Okay, so how do you get approved for that particular thing, individual unemployability? Well, the, uh, the first step is to have a service-connected condition. Okay. Um, and uh, once that is done, you would file an application saying, I have this service-connected condition, and because of it, I actually can't work. Then the VA will do um, a quick analysis of what they think the limitations are that are caused by that service-connected condition. Um, and then they'll do a, kind of a basic vocational analysis to see whether that person's um, experience and education, along with those restrictions, would allow for that person to be able to work. Um, and a lot of times uh, the VA will deny those claims and say that there are actually jobs that the person might be able to, um, uh, to do. Uh, that could then, be disheartening. Yeah, it is. And, um, you know, a lot of these veterans are really struggling and, uh, you know, and that's where we can come in and help. Well, and that was my next question because all of those steps that you listed there could be really overwhelming for somebody in this position thinking, oh my gosh, I can't navigate this by myself. So how can Tayback Law help? Yeah, that's right. Well. Um, you know, we could take a claim at any step from helping to file that initial application for um, uh, the unemployability to helping once it's been denied. Um, and typically when it's denied and we get into the appeal process, what we can do is um, work with the person's doctors to get a real uh, solid idea of what the restrictions actually are. Mm -hmm. And sometimes that even involves sending them out for external testing with area professionals such as physical therapists or mental health professionals um, and possibly even getting a vocational expert to do a vocational analysis to really show the VA that this person has much more uh, a much more difficult time than what the VA had originally assessed. I like how you just sort of went like once it's denied then blah blah because I think people immediately would hear denied and go Oh my gosh, I, now what? And it's not a scary thing. You can, you can still achieve the unemployability beyond that. And that's something that you do regularly so that people don't have to be scared of it. That's right. Um, we have a, a, a very good track record of success when we take a, a case on. And, um, you know, the VA, uh, sometimes it's, it's not a matter of the VA being wrong. It, it's sometimes just a matter of them not having the information they need to actually approve. They're just them. uninformed. That's right. And, um, it's so complicated that veterans on their own aren't always aware of what they need either or mm -hmm. sometimes unfortunately it's just expensive to get what they need and that's where you know a law firm can come in and we'll use our resources to really get that case worked up to the way it needs to be. But now they're saying okay so how much does this cost? Yes and that's uh, obviously a great question. Um, the way that it works with a VA claim is we do not get paid unless we would win uh, the case for the veteran. And if we do win, the way that we get paid is we get paid as a percentage of the back pay. So it's, it's not money that the veteran would ever owe us out of their pocket. Um, the VA will uh, uh, put aside a portion, 20% of the back pay, and then that's how we get paid. So they never even have to worry about it, really. That's right. It, that will never have to cross your mind. <laughs> so can people fight for their benefits on their own? Yeah, of course they can. Um, but again, as I had mentioned, a lot of times people just either don't know what they need to get a claim approved, or if they do know, they don't have the resources to get what they need. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, Jim, thank you so much. And uh, free wills for all veterans, that's your special offer today? That is, yes. That's, that's amazing. Yeah, yeah, that's something we just started. Um, and 
um, we had been doing, you know, events where we would get together and, and do uh, some wills for veterans, but we just decided to make it universal. Anyone that stops in our office, we can, in their veteran, we'll, we'll do a will for them at no cost. That's fantastic. That is so great yeah, because I you. think that's also an intimidating thing yeah. to prepare and to even get yourself geared up to do that is a little bit mm -hmm. scary. But when you can, when you can go in knowing I'm not even going to have to pay for this, that's right. it takes a little bit of that away. And you do not have to be a current client either to get that. Any veteran, stop by, give us a call and we'd be happy to uh, look at your situation and, and um, if you fit the parameters, we'll do a free will for you. That's fantastic. Thank you so much, yeah, Jim. And you. here's what we want viewers to do right now. Those of you out here who this applies to you, uh, free wills for all veterans, once again, 414-351-4400 is the number that you're going to call to make your appointment. And you can go to taybackattorneys.com online to find out more as well.